Hello. Today we are going to talk about the one and only John Napier. At first glance, he may not seem like an interesting dude. I mean, look at him. Though he is not a very well-known mathematician like Pythagoras, Isaac Newton, Euclid, Archimedes, René Descartes, Mr. Green, this Scottish mathematician is very well known for inventing logarithms and natural logs. Anywho. John Napier was born on 1550 in the Merkhiston Castle in Edinburgh, Scotland. Fun fact, today the Merkhiston Castle settles on the school campus of the Edinburgh Napier University. At the age of 13, he went to school at the St. Salvatore's College, St. Andrews, but he received poor education due to the ongoing Reformation and left without taking a degree. John Napier began working on logarithms in 1594. In 1614, he published the Mirophysi Logarithm Orum Canonis Descriptio also known as the description of the marvelous canon of logarithms. Two years after his death, the Mirophysi Logarithm Orum Canonis Constructio also known as construction of the marvelous canon of logarithms was published. These two treatises outline the steps leading to the invention of the logarithm, which were meant to simplify calculations. To explain logarithms for you, here we have our special guest John Napier. I discovered that the basis for logarithms was the relationship between an arithmetical sequence following a geometric sequence. In a geometric sequence each term forms a constant ratio with its successor. For example, this has a common ratio of 10. In an arithmetic sequence each successive term differs by a common difference. For example, has a common difference of 1. Multiplying two numbers in the geometric sequence, like 1 tenth and 100, is equal to adding the corresponding exponents of the common ratio, negative 1 and 2, to obtain 10 to the first power equals 10. As you can see multiplication is transformed into addition. Like every other math concept, logarithms have their own rules. Let's simplify log 100. Since 100 equals 10 to the second power, then log 100 equals log 10 to the second power equals 2. I hope you enjoyed learning about John Napier's life and his contribution to math. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.